On this video, I'm going to be reviewing some Timu storage products for your kitchen. And then I think there's one thing that's not for the kitchen. Okay, so let me go ahead and just be straight with you. This stuff I got, wait, I don't know probably two months ago. I just didn't end up doing the video, just ran out of time. But I wanted to go ahead and bring this stuff to you because I got some good stuff. Now, Timu, they only give me like a little bit to play with, so I have to be real strategic on what I order and what I get. But this time, I wanted to kind of go to more of a storage container thing. So I just ordered a bunch of different storage containers to see if they would work. So now I'm gonna give you prices that I paid for this, but as you know, Timu is up and down on prices, so it could be a different price today, and I will try to link everything I can in the description box. But the first thing that I got was this here. It's a flip top and it holds your cheese. So like if you like sliced cheese, you can put your cheese in here and then you can just grab it out. Now I will tell you, a whole pack of cheese will not fit in here, so they all will not fit. It's not tall enough. I mean, if you wanted to kind of keep your cheese contained in the refrigerator, which in an RV would probably be a good thing, I think this would totally work. It keeps it all in this little pack. It's small and compact. This was $1.99. Now the next one, this was $3.59. It is a rice or cereal container. It's, it has a really good seal on it and it holds really tight. It snaps in. And then you even have a little measuring cup if you needed it so that if you wanted to pour something from here into a measuring cup, you could do that as well. It's in Chinese, but you know, you can use your phone to see what it says. But it also has a seal around there to keep that sealed in as well. I like the profile for an RV because it's really narrow and it can slide into a place. I think for $3.49, this is a pretty good buy. Then the next thing that I got was this little storage container. This was $1.79 for this little storage container. It's just, <laughs> the lid goes on there really good. <laughs> It has a really good sealing lid. The only thing is it got broke when it got sent to me. So just to note, you know, Timu, that's the only thing that I can say negative about Timu is that they don't package their stuff if it's something that can break. So this did break, like I said, in past videos, because I'm an influencer, they don't like to replace this, but if you, contact them. They are so quick and easy. They answer everything really fast because I have gotten where I've been buying quite a bit of clothes off of there. And if y'all want me to do a haul on clothing from Timu, let me know. But I've been buying some clothes off of there and uh, I'm very well impressed with some of this clothing for the price. But if you are an individual, they handle things so much different than they do for us. I don't know why. Maybe it's because they're giving it to me for free and they think, okay, it doesn't matter that it broke. Now this one, you can put cheese in it as well. And actually for the cheese, I kind of like it a little better because the lid comes all the way off. The other one pops up and it sometimes can be a little hard to grab the cheese out of there, but that one was $1.99. This one's $3.49. So this one is a little bit more expensive but it the lid snaps on and it holds your cheese just as good and i could see putting like all kinds of different produce or little things in here for travel for the rv and if you got more than one of these it has like a little lip so these would stack on top of each other and kind of stay together which would be another good reason to camp with it so this next thing they were 4.99 for five of them and they're like these little containers they're supposed to be for like holding liquids spill proof liquid bags i filled ours up with water just to make sure that it doesn't leak and it does not leak at all now we do not have a water filtration system and we should probably 
But what I usually do is I have got these jugs that I just fill up water from the house and put them in the camper and then I travel with them. But these right here are a little bit smaller and a little bit more low profile. That's what I'm gonna use these for is I'm gonna fill up some of these with water instead of using these big jugs. And then I can just take several of these. I We use this for like our coffee and the dog's water, that's it. I mean, that's what I, I mean, maybe you might could think of more things to do with this. I was thinking like, it would be good like if you had soup, you could put soup in there. You're just gonna have to have a funnel to get it in. The water's easy to put in because the stream goes in, but putting food or something in here might be a little more difficult. Now this is like a produce organizer for your fridge and this was $5.99. I have one that I had got off of Amazon and I think this one is just as good for a lot cheaper. It's got the little basket so like if you wanted to cut produce, put it in there, you could rinse it off and then stick it back in here. I love mine that I have at the house like this that I had gotten off of Amazon, but this one from Timu I think is just as good. At Dollar Tree, you can get the same thing for like $1.25. This was $1.69. It's just a squeegee for the shower. The way Timu does it, they give me a certain amount that I have to buy. I had to put something on there, so this is what got put on there because it was just needed to be $1.69. <laughs> So that's how this ended up being on there, which I mean like this is nice and if you're ordering a bunch of other stuff or if you can try to get it when it's on sale or something, you might would want to do that. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Till next time, like and subscribe.